Thank you for waiting, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome our business class passengers, U.S. friends, are personally informed to board now or in time during the boarding process on our canal site 919 to Atlanta to the property lane. What's going on, everybody? Ryan Pittman from your sales enablement team here. And uh, hey, we spent enough time in Miami. Let's take, a, let's take this thing on a road trip. T-Rock road trip. landed in Atlanta. Uh, we're going to grab our bags, grab some, some of the things we had to bring up into town with us in the training. Uh, then we got to hit the store, get some supplies for the meetings, and uh, get prepared for uh, for tonight's launch event for our brand new client. That may be a, uh, a cool shot to get a plane going up, like for the start of it. Our whole morning's been nothing but walking. Walking, walking, walking. About 12. You guys want me to go next with updates? Hang up. Oh, sorry. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> awesome. So <clears throat> um, obviously, you know, my, the, the majority of my time has been really, you know, focused on standing up, uh, you know, in, in support of, uh, you know, mainly the training and then, you know, or the logistics around the training. Uh, you know, getting everybody here, uh, working with talent acquisition to ensure that flights are booked and following up with a travel agent and, um, you know, making sure everybody's going to the right place at the right time. Okay, there should have been a few more. Uh, this is one that I said, there should have been way more than this. Okay. Yeah, there should have been six pieces on these. With this one? With this one, with the same tracking number. Okay. And then um, there was some boxes from Land's End that were sent earlier too. And there should have been two boxes. Name? Yeah, is that all that? This came see? a few days ago. Okay. I, I haven't gotten the mail for today. So this came two nights ago. Yeah, if, cause yeah, if we look, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to put these on a bell cart and then I'm gonna take them up to up to uh, my room because okay. I, I get some sorting and stuff to okay. do on them. So. so let me go take a peek in the closet to see. Awesome. And just to confirm, you guys are not going to do food and beverage. Correct. Okay. Correct. Yeah, I'm going to bring. Yeah, I'm going to. Yeah, I'm going to. Yeah, I'm going to bring bring some other stuff okay. in, if you don't mind. No, um, but yeah, the room room looks good. You guys clean for us. Thanks. <laughs> awesome. I started working at a young age, right? I think. Uh, I started volunteering for uh, the minor league basketball team that, that played in West Palm Beach when I was growing up. Moved up uh, actually here to Atlanta, and uh, when I did, I started working in the NBA with the Atlanta Hawks and the Atlanta Falcons, and uh, <coughs> excuse me, even the Thrashers hockey team when they were around. Uh, just you know, being in, working in the equipment room and kind of doing any job that needed to be done. And uh, you know, those those guys work hard in that industry, and uh, you know, I really just think I was kind of branded from uh, from the get go to to you know just do whatever it takes to get the job done. You know, we don't count hours, just uh, just do whatever it takes. Little portable office, goes with me everywhere. You know, my high school years, uh, I was more on the north end of Atlanta and we're in the south now, so this, this area isn't too familiar with me, but uh, still pretty cool feeling. You know, being a, having, having worked in pro sports, you know, I, I worked a, a lot in the Georgia Dome, and I know that place is going to be coming down, so I know you know at some point uh, over the next couple of days when we pass it, that'll uh, that'll be kind of surreal. All right, here we are getting ready for tomorrow. All our supplies for the class. Made sure we had everything on our list. So we don't miss anything. You know, get one chance to make a first impression, right? It's gotta look good for everybody. So we got our list done early. We have to treat ourselves. And when we, whenever you're on the road, you gotta eat at the famous places. So we just ran over to the Varsity here in Atlanta. Bon appetit. <laughs> We're having a, uh, a launch party. Our CEO, Brett, and our COO, Mark, as well as the project director, Leah, are uh, putting together a launch event uh, tonight just to celebrate the, uh, you know, the exciting time when, of bringing on a new client and a brand new project. What, 
this is is T-Rock embedded, right? So I don't know if you had a chance to look at some of the videos on Facebook, but being as, you know, our company, when you first hear T-Rock, you know, what, what's everybody's question? What the heck do you guys do, right? Yeah. So, you know, what we're doing is we're filming a series of behind the scenes videos, right? And they follow all kinds of different people, you know, through, in the company throughout the day in their life. So this one was mine. So uh, Eddie met me at the at the airport this morning. It's been fun. It's been fun. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So it's good stuff, man. So how are we finishing up the night here? Got to get everybody their stuff. Um, we have our care packages here. That's everything that they're going to need to uh, start off the training uh, first thing in the morning. So. We just left a party, had a great dinner, great bonding experience, great, uh, you know, great reviews from our, uh, you know, from from our new T Rockers, of uh, you know, just of, of how how much of a different experience this has been coming to work here, and uh, and the love that they've seen come from the company to them uh, right off the bat. So uh, we're going to continue that. We're going to give them all the stuff that they're going to need, and uh, we're going to see them first thing in the morning. We're going to train them up right.